everybody and welcome back to another get ready with me I know I'm way behind in these I've got two other ones that I haven't even uploaded yet <laughs> but I thought I would do this today because I got a call from CCC this morning which is our temporary career placement agency here in town and um, told me about a job that is available for this week possibly next but probably only this week which is working um, the desk and the phones at a busy law office, which I'm really excited about. Um, I've done this kind of work before, back in my 20s, so it's been a very long time, but um, I'm excited. You know, it, it pays, I'm, I'm believing it's $10 an hour, um, which is going to be probably twice what I'd get in unemployment. So I'll just miss this week of unemployment is all. Um, I haven't even got my first check yet. I should get that this week, I'm hoping. I need to pay some bills really bad. I'm hurting unit right now, guys. And until I get a paycheck, until I get caught up, I'm going to be a hurting unit. So anyway, today I have um, took a shower. I moisturized. I used my spackle um, from Laura Geller. This is my all-time favorite primer. You guys know that. <clears throat> Today I'm going to use my Dream Velvet by uh, Maybelline. It's Soft Matte Hydrating Foundation in 15 Ivory. Shake that up a little bit if it will. Squish it around a little. Um, in case you haven't noticed, I, I don't want to get dressed yet. Because I still have about an hour until I have to be there. I just got a little ahead of myself here. But, um, and my robe, I just noticed, is just, the cat's been laying on it. So, I don't even want to put that on. So, I'm sitting here in my bra. <laughs> but you can't see it. You can just see the straps. And a bit more on my forehead here. I didn't use any of my color corrector today because I don't know that it's helping much anyway. And so I didn't. Okay. Dang it. I feel like I have a hair or something. Alright, so I am going to use, put this away, my Sonia Kashuk, um eyebrow gel. And I did not bring my deal in here so I can't tell. Looks like it's a soft brown or something. I don't know. I can't tell. But it's got a huge spoolie. The color looks good though. leftover from being I woke up today um, I didn't sleep real well I uh, finally went to sleep about three o'clock in the morning I think that was the last time I looked at the clock anyway and I don't think I was awake much later than that um, and was wide awake at six but I felt pretty good and then I went back to sleep and woke up at 9. There we go. Okay, I'm going to use my Ulta Eye Primer. I 
missed out on the ladies who collab because I was going to tape last night and I got sick so I didn't I'm gonna use my modern Renaissance today I'm not gonna use any of the crazy colors just the nice Let's colors see here so we will use tempera for my base I have just been, I don't know why, I've been afraid to use this dang thing. I've been wanting to do a eye look with this. But, um, I just haven't felt like taping. I just, depression sucks, guys. It just makes you not want to do anything and that you want to do. And I want to do this, but I just couldn't do it. So, anyway, um, oh my god, this is pigmented. Really nice color. This is Bonfresco. That is really pretty. Okay, now I have to decide what I'm going to use for my top coat. I guess the Primavera, which is a my goodness, this is crazy how pigmented this is. One coat will do ya. Or so many other ones I have to go in with at least two coats. Just want to make sure I got all that. Okay, I'm going to go over this one more time and blend it. It's very light, but it's okay. Wondering if I should go over this one more time with a little bit more color. I don't want to go over this too much because, um, or too dark. That actually looks a little better. Okay, show you what I used here quick. So I used this color for my base. I used this color for my transition and my crease color. Isn't that gorgeous? And I used this color for my lid. I just, I really am anxious to use these colors here, you know, all these here, dark ones, but I just haven't had a chance yet. All right, for eyelashes today, I'm starting over on my my uh, rotation here. Uh, I'm using the Grandissimo Lashes by Milani, which is this one. This is so, I love this. I don't even know if you guys can tell that I've done anything to my lashes. To this one anyway. So I will uh, try to take a picture once I get outside of my outfit 
that I'm wearing today. I'm just wearing black pants and black shoes and a black shirt with a design on it. Later on in the week, I might wear a skirt. All right. Um, I am not going to use any concealer today. I just, I just don't. I'm not feeling it, so I'm not going to use it. I just don't want uh, too much stuff on. Okay, for my blush today, I am going to use my MAC in At Dusk. It's the only MAC I have. I have very little MAC stuff to begin with. And this is my... One and only MAC blush. Such a pretty color. Such a pretty color. Then I'm going to use my Catrice Highlighting Powder in Champagne Campaign. <laughs> okay. Pretty. even see it a little bit I think and I'm going to use my um, L'Oreal Privy by Julianne and this is Julianne's nude in 620 that's what it looks like so pretty and there we go that is my look for today um, I will let you guys know how how it's going with the law firm and I'm really excited about this so I will see you guys later in my next video um I'll get these uploaded soon bye bye